Go. So finally, the piece has been completely tied and we're ready to build the pod. I'd like to talk a little bit about the, the competing courses of, um, of twine and why they've been placed in the position they've been placed. You could see that the horizontal ties have been made. It has allowed the springs to gang together running across and when we set the piece down we'll be able to see the elevations and how they're going to operate. And then additional courses were placed in between the springs so to stabilize the lines in between so that over time as the springs contract that the twine does not become abraded along the um, um, anchor points. So if you can see across, will the camera reach that far? To your finger. And back to the end of the um, course of springs and drops down just like we did in the front with a double tie which establishes the elevation which you will see later on is important relative to the inside arm because the inside arm will roll over the top of the arm structure and tack down to the base of the frame but will visually will terminate along the line of the springs and so the springs will establish that line as well. Coming back around to the front you're going to see a void. This is not typical in a spring up and this is peculiar to this piece the upholsters set less springs in. They decided to simply fill this section with stuffing rather than adding another course of springs. You can see that it runs out of room here, but the fact is, is they could have taken their springs and brought them just a little bit closer together and placed a spring in this position. We didn't have that ability to to um, change that without going to a completely different set of springs and so we stuck with the original spring up configuration and also we are reusing the original pod and conserving it so setting a, an additional spring in that area would have made it impossible to reuse and conserve that pod so we stuck with it we made some additions with the noose and additional ties that should wear much, much better over time. This very long strand of strings is now well protected so as it flexes and wants to abrade, it will not break as it did originally. Okay.